So coming to acetic acid, children, acetic acid is not the CH3COOH. Normally, when HCl we are doing, H is plus Cl minus. Plus is coming first, minus is coming uh, next in all mineral acids. Here are all mineral acids. These are called mineral acids. This is called organic acid because carbon is there. Here, if you break into ions, you will get CH3COO minus phosphate and H plus minus. Minus will come first, H plus will come second. That is the organic compound. That's why these all are mineral acids. This is called organic acid, ethanoic acid or acetic acid. So when I'm doing, be careful with the ions. Here for your understanding, for two or three questions, I will do ions. After that, I will stop doing the ions. Okay. So we will start with acetic acid or the reason. First one is acetic acid with potassium hydroxide. Acetic acid with the potassium hydroxide. So CH3COO minus K is plus plus H2. So plus one minus one cancel. So what is the formula of potassium acid? CH3COO K is the potassium acid. It is well balanced. Okay, children. Now ions. CH3COO minus H plus. K plus OH minus CH3COO minus 1, K plus 1, H plus OH minus 1. Okay, now, what is the name of this acetic acid or ethanoic acid also they will say? This is called potassium hydroxide. Okay, potassium, and this is called, this salt is called potassium acetate. What is it called? Potassium acetate, potassium acetate and water. Naming is very important, children. If you learn to write the names, only, then you will understand the reaction. Always learning how to write the names is very very important because sometimes there will be word equations and they'll ask you to convert. You should be in a position to do. So, ionic equations will be very very quick. Next one, next one, CS three CO OK HH plus NaOH gives CS three CO Na. This and this CS three CO Na plus H two. Any equation I'm writing CH3COO minus H plus Na plus OH minus CH3COO minus Na plus H plus OH minus. Name of the equation this is called acetic acid. What is this called? Sodium hydroxide. What is this called? Sodium acetate. Sodium acetate and water. Okay. Check how I'm writing any equations. Be careful when you're writing. Okay. In exam, in exam, if I ask any equation, you should write these three steps. This is three steps in exam. If I ask, among all these acids, one acid I will ask. It. Among all these acids, one or two acids, along with all these bases, I'll ask in Sunday exam. Be careful. Okay, next one, third one, last reaction where I'm writing any equation. After this, I won't write. CH3COOH plus what is the next acid? A base calcium hydroxide. CH3COO is minus calcium is plus 2. So you will get uh, 2 goes here, 1 comes here. So the formula turns out to be calcium acetate formula is CH3COO taken twice Ca calcium acetate. Balancing 2 acetate ions are there, so put here 2. Okay. Here two hydrogens, here two hydrogens, four hydrogens now. So put here two. Balanced. Everything is balanced. Okay. And ionic equation CH3COO minus and H plus. Ca is plus two. OH is minus one. CH3COO minus Ca is plus two. H plus OH minus. Word equation writing. Acetic acid, calcium hydroxide, calcium hydroxide. Calcium acetate, calcium acetate plus water, plus water. Writing reactions is very important. If you are perfect now only, in future chemistry will become easy. CH3COOH, what is the next base? Magnesium hydroxide. You are going to get magnesium acetate. CH3COO taken twice because magnesium is plus 2, no? 2 will come down. Plus H2O. Two acetate ions and two two here balanced. Okay, this is magnesium acetate. Okay, next reaction: acetic acid with acetic acid with aluminium hydroxide. Can anyone tell what is the formula of aluminium acetate? Anyone likes to tell? Aluminium acetate formula. Anyone? Anyone in the class? 
I'll give you my state formula. Anyone in the class? Vedant? I'll give you my state. CCO taken thrice. Then? CH3COO taken twice AL plus H2O taken thrice because aluminum is plus 3. This is minus. Okay. So 3 estate ions are there. 3 estate ions. Okay. And here, how many hydrogens? Here 3, here 3, 6, 1. So put here 3, it is balanced. This is called aluminum estate. Those who didn't understand, see here. CH3, I'm showing here. CH3COO minus AL is plus 3. 3 comes here, 1 goes there. So CH3COO taken thrice AL aluminum acetate. Okay, children, aluminum acetate. Next. Next one, sixth one. Acetic acid, acetic acid plus zinc hydroxide. We are expecting zinc acetate and water. CH3, COO taken twice, zinc plus water. Two acetate ions are there, put here two. Here two hydrogens, here two hydrogens. Next, CH3, COOH plus ferrous hydroxide. What you are expecting here? Ferrous acetate, CH3, COO taken twice, Fe plus H2O. Sometimes reactions won't occur, children. This is only for our practicing and making you do that salt. Sometimes some reactions are not possible, okay? Next, last one, acetic acid with acetic acid with lead hydroxide. Acetic acid with lead hydroxide. CH3COOH plus PBOH taken twice gives lead acetate. CH3COO taken twice PB plus H2O. Two acetate ions are there. Put two here. Here two hydrogens. Here two hydrogens. Four. So put here two. It is well balanced. This is called acetic acid. Lead hydroxide gives lead acetate. What is the name? Lead acetate plus water. So these are the neutralization reactions of all acids also I told you. Copy them fast. 10 seconds and give 10, copy them fast. 